Good morning, everyone. Oh my goodness, so excited because I believe I never ever wait in a line for an iPhone pickup. So very, very excited because I've been using the iPhone 7 Plus for a while now. And then today we're gonna upgrade to the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Ooh, can't wait, can't wait to see how good this is the camera quality. But yeah, we are at the Pacific Center, so let's go. Finally got the iPhone 14 Pro Max over here. Check out this purple one, the 128. Oh, cannot wait to switch it to this main camera's vlogging. Myself, a MagSafe charger. Never thought how this would work, but you know what? I'll try it out and see how it works out. Oh man, here we go. Wow. Ooh. Ready? Let's do this. So you can see in different lighting, man. I don't know, right now sometimes it shows purple, but sometimes it shows almost like a silver graphite, kinda like that, but see? Wow, that looks like silver, so I kinda dig this kind of color, wow. Alright, so just a quick comparison to the current phone that I'm using and finally upgrading to the 14 Pro Max Purple 128. This is actually the 7 Plus, and look at the lens compared to that then 7 Plus and the 14 Pro Max 7 Plus 14 Pro Max Wow! Turning on for the first time Ooh. Oh man Alright, so let's set this up and see what's new with the iPhone 14 Pro Max Okay, so whew, we got everything set it up Man, it's such a beautiful phone. Ah, so excited. First big thing everyone's talking about is actually it's called the Dynamic Island. Wow, they're so smart with the notch design. So what it does is let's say if you're playing Spotify like so, and then you're playing. Tell us about yourself. And then if you swipe up, incredible. So if I were to press it, see it pops up like a little player. That is truly genius. So it's almost like a second multitasker with no kind of sorts. One of my favorites is the Apollo app. If you can see right there, there's a little doggy or cat that you can actually choose any of your pets. Uh, right at the little top bottom of it. A animation oh my goodness oh, that is so cute so one thing I noticed right away man this is like a fingerprint magnet on the side here I barely probably only use it for like 20 minutes oh it is really really smudgy so if you want to prevent that you can definitely get a case but you know what literally no case I'm gonna challenge that and of course I got Apple Care, so that's for that because man I don't know I've been using case a lot and I just feel bad always covering the back. I'm like, oh, it's just wasted the beautiful design. Oh, look at this purple. Compared to what I have back in the day in the 7 Plus iPhone, the camera bump here, oh, it is thick. I don't know if you can see it up close, man. That is like thick, thick, like really, really protruding. So one thing I can tell you right away, I think my eyes is not used to the 120 hertz, the ProMotion. Oh my, actually I'm, I was getting really dizzy because everything is running so smooth. So beside the big battery life, few things that get me really really excited because I'm a video content creator and do a lot of photo editing as well. I love to test it out in the photo, the 48 megapixel. Ooh, I wonder how detailed is that gonna be. All the video previous right now, it's actually all shot on Hero 9 GoPro and I was really surprised even that tiny camera in good lighting condition, it's really really capable. There's a feature called action mode. So while I've seen some video samples, it's almost similar to GoPro Hyper Smooth. But you know what? I would definitely want to do a comparison in the future and see how much it can handle. So next up is definitely the cinematic mode in 4K finally because my girlfriend has the 13 Pro Max in 1080p. I really enjoy it but I was like, huh, I wonder if they're gonna go 4K and they did it. Cannot wait, definitely would do maybe a short film, who knows. When you shoot in cinematic mode and you can even edit the focus point after so that's pretty incredible. So you know how good music make or break your video, which is really really important especially if you're doing that intro, outro, and what I use is actually it's called the Epic Damage Sound. Now I love about it because like I was saying previously before, they have so many music to choose from. So make sure to click that link below to sign up for two months of free trial. Also I got some accessory, we got the MagSafe charger, I'll tell you honestly, I never used one before so I love to see how it works out. 
one of my favorite accessory definitely do unboxing and uh, in-depth review for you guys later so this is the anchor mag go 622 oh i heard really good reviews about it so this has been the unboxing and first impression of the iphone 14 pro max 128 oh such a beautiful beautiful phone and if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Would be really appreciated. And definitely in upcoming a lot of videos, we're all about iPhone, um, the photo and video testing. And I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye.